why was your, let me come back to my original question. Why was your office so intent on shutting down any talk about this being involved with a lab? Why? I don't understand it. Why the hysteria? So Senator Hawley, I will say that my understanding of the situation is that the, um, no one at NIH, including Dr. Collins, Dr. Fauci, myself, ever suggested that there wasn't the possibility that a virus had escaped from a lab. Oh, that's ridiculous. I think that I mean, that is, let me just stop you right there. I just can't, I cannot have these lies just continue to be told over and over again. Sorry. And wrong. That's false. You people repeatedly, repeatedly said it could not have come from a lab. Your boss said it was a very destructive conspiracy. Not that it was unlikely, not that it was not the best idea, a conspiracy. And based on that, you censored and your administration that you worked for actively censored scientists, journalists, and what we now know is our own intelligence agencies at the same time were concluding and briefing members of Congress that it likely was from a lab leak. I mean, it's extraordinary. And now you've been caught red handed because you, you thought that the rest of us wouldn't find out. You thought that the public would always be kept in the dark. And as it turns out, we now know these emails have become public that you were pushing this propaganda effort and yet claiming the mantle of science. Don't you see that what you have done has set back the respectability and integrity of science by generations? You were acting as propagandists. Do you regret your role in any of this? So Senator Hawley, I don't think you've characterized Do you my regret role your role, role in any of, of the misleading of the public? Do you regret your role in your office saying that a, a lab nexus here is a very destructive conspiracy? Do you regret your role in helping censor millions of Americans who were kicked off social media, who were disciplined at work for saying that maybe a lab was involved, which we now know the FBI thinks is the fact the case? Do you regret it? I do not believe I ever had the role that you're describing. Do you regret anything that you did during this period? Do you regret not speaking out? Do you regret not advising your boss to temper his comments? Do you regret not opposing the censorship? Do you regret it? You're in a position I, of tremendous influence. I do not believe censorship took place, sir. You don't believe censorship took place? I do not. What world are you living in? Tell that to the scientists who basically lost their credentials, tell that to the people who were kicked off of social media and banned because they asked about a lab leak. You don't believe censorship took place? The privilege is astounding. You were the chief of staff at the NIH pushing these conspiracies, pushing the effort to shut down Americans, and now you have the gall to sit here and say censorship never took place. I mean, it's unbelievable. Senator. Unbelievable. Senator. I can't believe, Senator. I cannot believe that that's your testimony. And frankly, I can't believe you have the gall to sit here and say that. Thank you, Mr. Chairman.